Good morning vlog. The last couple days everybody's been freaking out about the snowstorm that's supposed to hit southern Ontario and it's supposed to be this big big thing. And yesterday there was absolutely no snow. And now look what's going on. This is ridiculous. And I'm gonna go play in it. Bye. Bye. I don't know if I can open the door. Let me out. Oh dear. Guys, I don't know if this is such a good idea. Look at the beautiful snow. I'm wearing boots. And my boots can't handle this. I think the snow is actually above my shoes. Yep, I can feel it on my legs. That that little tough thingy, that's where my boot ends. Um, guys, I don't know what to do. This is amazing. I'm gonna fall down the stairs. Okay, I made it. I'm outside, I'm down the stairs. Look, I made a disaster of the stairs. It's beautiful. And nobody needs jackets when we have Canada outside sweaters, which by the way, you can get at districtglides.com slash apprentice with an A. But this snow is hitting me in the face really hard. And it's probably really windy on the mic, so I hope you can still hear me. Um, everybody else is too cool to go outside. Or too warm to go outside. They don't want to be out here because it's cool. I don't know, whatever. There on the roof you can see a nice, nice mark of how much snow there is. And keep in mind, there was nothing last night, not even a little bit. It started overnight and now there's just snow everywhere and it's glorious, but you guys are getting wet. So I'm gonna bring you back inside. This is the kind of weather that makes you wish you had snow pants. Guess what guys, I have some really exciting news. On Thursday, my brother and his wife had a baby girl. That's exciting. Whee! It's like not even a surprise anymore. Haven't you already had a family member have a baby in the vlog? <laughs> Not in the vlog, I don't think. I feel like you've totally said that before in the vlog. Have I? I don't know, how many babies does your family have? Because it's a lot. Ten. This is ten now. You have ten nieces and nephews? Yeah. I have none. <laughs> and I'm 26. <laughs> Maybe. I well, I feel... When was the most recent baby born other I think than the baby that was just born? Isabella was born... She was born July 25th. I think that might have been last year. Yeah. Uh, no, 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 it was, it was the year before I started. Okay. Okay. Alright. Yeah. So anyways, my parents are, oh, they just pulled um, into the driveway. Um, we are going to go see the baby and she is very cute from the pictures that I've seen. But I, anyways, I'm really, really excited. So I will talk to you guys later. You can't leave. You can't leave yet. I made you tea in your Batman mug. Oh, but I'll take it with me. And I have my Star Wars mug. Aww. I wanted us to drink tea together. Oh, you can come with. No. <laughs> I don't like babies. I like the Shay Tarts kids. Mm -hmm. But out of all of them, Rock Tart completely ignored me. <laughs> Two year olds cool don't you. need me. Mm -hmm. zero, zero to three, I find to be a pretty useless age. <laughs> then three to ten is good. Then they start hitting early puberty and get really selfish again. Um, mm -hmm. So if 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 ba if children could just stay between three and ten, I would love them. And okay. I'm really great with that age range. But all of the other ages are awful. <laughs> Hi, I'm sick because I have been around this fellow so long. <coughs> Lovely. Yeah, thank you. <coughs> You're, not <laughs> You're not sick as He's not sick. I want to be sick too. Me. Oh, give me a high five. I just uh, coughed all over the nose. Yeah. That's oh, gross. That's, so That's gross. Oh. I won't get sick. At first, I thought, because I went to a party a couple of days ago, so I thought it was just because I'd been yelling all day and I was just kind of hoarse. But it's kind of stayed for a You're couple a days. And now, like, I worried. I'm worried that I'm gonna get the whole pink eye and no. then the weird gross cough and then just general gross disgusting sick presence that Corey has had for the past few days. And I'm just really sad. I have a really good immune system usually. Oh, okay. I'm healthy as a horse. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I do. Okay. Because so far, the only people to not get sick have been Saskia and myself. Yeah, and now you're going to get me sick because you just spread his germs all over your face. Yeah, hey, yeah, that's, yeah, that's, how come that's the plan. I don't get sick because I, well, I welcome other people's diseases. And then spread them on to everybody else. That's not my problem. That's, he's like, he's like the carrier. Problem. He just like transports the disease the from one person. I am the rats that caused the plague. To <laughs> <laughs> you transport it from like... Corey, to you, to 
to Saskia, and then you don't have to get sick, but you've passed it along, so the germs are like, okay, well, I guess, thanks for the ride, bud. We'll probably you're like a, for that. <laughs> the germs are like hitchhikers, and you're just a really kindly old fellow who's giving them a ride. <laughs> Sounds about right to me. Okay, this isn't why I started vlogging. Okay, so a while ago, I was doing the whole eating Vegemite every week thing, and I stopped that because... I felt like I had done my work and I didn't have to eat it anymore. Okay, so I was watching the vlog where I first eat Vegemite for the first time. I saw in the comments that the girl who sent us the Vegemite says, I know I sent you Vegemite, but you can get my first Vegemite, which is for like little kids in Australia. So here I am thinking, what? 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 You need like a starter kit? For Vegemite? Is that what's happening? So I look it up, and as you can see, there's this darling little child just licking out of a, a thing of Vegemite. I don't, I don't understand. Okay, well there are things in our culture slash countries that people eat and drink that really don't make any sense. Like yeah, coffee. right. You have to get used to coffee. Yeah, and but like no. Licorice. You have to get used to licorice. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. <laughs> Let me just explain. There are things that, like, I eat that I know are super gross to people who aren't used to it. Like, coffee is gross. I also eat druppies, but I've been eating druppies since I was a kid, so they're good to me. But this means that even little babies think that Vegemite is gross, so they have to acclimate them to eating it by getting them my first Vegemite, which is, like, milder less and less gross. <laughs> And then they eat the Vegemite. Why? Why would you go to so much work just to eat <laughs> Vegemite, which is already gross? Is I it, don't it, get it. Is it like really good for you? I don't even is think it, like, so. Super, there's like super healthy or something. There's, uh, it's really salty, but it has a lot of like vitamin B. But that's it. Like it's got nothing going for it. I don't understand. Australia, help me out here. I don't know what you guys are doing over there, but why are you feeding your children my first Vegemite if they don't like it? That being said, she does look pretty cute eating this little, little tub of Vegemite, and I did find that I enjoyed it after the first few times. Like it's sort of like a salty, savory breakfast toast thing. So I would encourage people to try it, but I don't know if I would make your kids eat it and then like force them to like it. I think that's a bit mean. But I'm really glad I did it, and maybe maybe we'll have another Vegemite session in the vlog sometime soon, <laughs> but not right now. Hey vlog, so like I said yesterday, I was going to continue working on that one Justin Bieber shot with the suitcase. Well, it turns out that we do actually have a blue suitcase, and we just happen to have a carpet that matches the colors and like the patterns of the video shot perfectly. So I asked Corrado to help me move a rug on top of the bed, yeah. which he wasn't very happy about. Well, I mean, I'm happy that the floor under the rug is clean. Yes. That's good. Well, clean. It's clean. Clean-ish. Clean enough. Uh, and so instead of just putting a rug on the bed, we put like a towel down under yeah. it. Yeah. So simple. So this way when <laughs> I actually want to go to bed, it's not going to be a messy bed sheet. Yes. And just throw it off to the side and go to sleep. Yeah. The reason we didn't do it on the ground is because that would be a really hard shot to light. The camera angle would be really hard. And the camera angle would be weird. So now we just gotta film this thing. Yeah. And then we're good to go. Uh -huh. Look at that shot. That's like It's perfect a pretty, match. pretty perfect. It's pretty perfect. If Our only... suitcase is not as pretty, but that's okay. That's the only difference. So we're just gonna film that and then we'll see you all tomorrow. Good night. Daily vlogs, I want them in my subscription box I wonder who might drop by Even though sometimes it's Canada outside So don't go away, we're here every day It's not Apprentice A, it's Apprentice A Hey, 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 hey Home is where the vlog is